top 10 inventors that died because of their inventions. Have you ever thought about who invented such a complicated device as a gun? And what was the reason that person invented a gun? Was he threatened by his neighbor? Most inventors do not die because of their own inventions, but some inventors unfortunately have not been able to repeat them. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're going to look at 10 inventions that have taken the life of their inventor. But before we go any further, make sure you hit the like button. And if you haven't subscribed to our channel yet, now's your chance. With all that said, let's get started on what you're all here for. Number 10, Alexander Bogdanov. Alexander Bogdanov was not a big name in America, but in the Soviet Union, he was famous. Science fiction writer, physician, and pioneer of cybernetics, he was curious about everything, including the thing that killed him. But how did he die? Well, he became interested in the possibilities of blood transfusions, especially when it came to life extension. Bogdanov believed that he could even make himself immortal if only he gave enough transfusions. In the 1920s, he gave himself transfusion after transfusion, publishing articles about their beneficial effects. His eyesight was better, he claimed. He no longer went bald. Friends even told him he looked 10 years younger. That got into his head, and he decided to take another blood transfusion. Unfortunately for him, he infused blood from a malaria student. The student survived. Bogdanov died. I guess he wasn't immortal after all. Number 9. William Nelson According to the New York Times, William Nelson was considered a promising inventor. But 24-year-old General Electric employee William Nelson tried to spark a revolution and, I hate to say it, he failed miserably. In 1903, Nelson took the motorcycle he had invented for a test drive. While riding uphill, he fell off his motorcycle and was instantly dead. Unfortunately for William, he was unable to continue developing the motorcycle. Number 8. Perillus of Athens Of all the inventors of technology and such, this man was responsible for inventing ways to die. You heard me right. He invented ways to execute people. It was his idea to design a device called the Brazen Bull to painfully execute criminals. So how did this happen? Well, the bull was hollow inside. Inside the hollow part of the bull, the criminal was placed. Then the bull was set on fire and the person was literally roasted. In fact, the device was even designed to channel the screams of the burning prisoner through the nose of the bull so that the prisoner sounded like a bull. To make a long story short, when the torture device was presented to Feralus, a tyrannical leader of Sicily, he was tremendously excited. He liked it so much that he decided to test it on Perillos, the inventor of the torture device. The rest I leave to your imagination. This seems to be one of the most painful deaths I can imagine. Number 7. William Bullock Sometimes inventions can cause more problems than instant death, and here's an example. In 1863, as the invention of the rotary printing press was gaining momentum, the original inventor Bullock had an accident. He crushed his foot while installing and testing a new machine in Philadelphia. His foot developed gangrene. I hear you thinking, what is gangrene? The term gangrene is used for dead tissue. His foot got worse and worse, and the decision was made to amputate his foot. Unfortunately, he did not survive an attempted amputation. After all, it was only 1863, and the knowledge and skill about amputation at the time was not as developed as it is today. Here's a bonus fact, completely free. Did you know that more than 70% of people who have had to amputate a limb still have feelings in the amputated limb after amputation? This is called phantom limb pain. This can manifest as itching, cramping, or stabbing pain in the amputated limb. Crazy, right? Number 6. Thomas Midgley Jr. Things don't always go as planned, especially when ropes are involved. Thomas Midgley Jr. contracted polio at the age of 51, but that didn't stop him from inventing tools. He developed an ingenious system of ropes and pulleys to get out of bed. In 1944, he was caught in his device and died of strangulation. It all ended with him accidentally strangling himself with one of the ropes in his bed. Yet another inventor who died because of his own invention. Are you enjoying this video already? Please leave a like and make sure you are subscribed. Number 5. Mary Curie 
You might be familiar with this name because she's won the Nobel Prize twice. She was a Polish chemist and physicist who pioneered research into radioactivity. The only thing that got in the way of her receiving more Nobel Prizes was probably her habit of carrying test tubes of plutonium in her pockets. At the time, it was simply not known how harmful radioactivity was to the human body. That explains why the poor lady died. Besides proposing the theory of radiation and the discovery of two elements, she is also credited with the invention of radiography or x-rays. But being exposed to radiation for so long caused her to die of a plastic anemia. Luckily, because of her death, people today do know that radiation is harmful. Number 4. Otto Lilienthal No doubt the technologies we have today are the fruits of the hard work and sometimes sacrifices of our ancestors. So are the inventions of Otto Lilienthal, the Glider King. Otto was a German pioneer in aviation. Lilienthal made more than 2,000 gliding flights because he had studied birds more than enough. He perfected the wing design and set the long-held record of gliding to 1,820 feet. So, it was an ordinary day for Lilienthal as he flew a standard glider at an altitude of about 50 feet, until his plane veered off and crashed, resulting in him breaking his neck. He died the next day in a Berlin hospital. Number 3. Franz Reichelt Who doesn't want to fly? And I'm not talking about airplanes, but an invention that neither of us thinks is worth trying. It all starts with an Austrian-born tailor. Franz Reichelt developed a parachute that pilots would wear as a safety device in case of emergency. I must say that it was very nice of him to come up with that, but he was not rewarded for it. He wanted to test his invention by using himself as a test subject. By 822, Reichelt was at the top of the Eiffel Tower, ready to jump. Aware that 187 feet below him was hard ground, he jumped and the parachute folded around Reichelt almost immediately. Guess what happened next? He fell, leaving a crater 5.9 inches deep. Number 2. Carol Sukek The life of a stuntman is not always easy, and here's another case where a device made to help you ended up costing you the rest of the years of your life. This Canadian stuntman died in a vessel he invented to survive a waterfall stunt. Sukek took his capsule, or should I say, a reinforced barrel, to the top of the Houston Astrodome. There, a 180-foot waterfall awaited him. Foam pads placed at the top of the tank to catch Sukek's fall had floated to the surface before the barrel was released. The capsule made an unplanned turn and struck the edge of the plunge pool, injuring Sukek. Although he was alive when he was pulled from the barrel, he died before the Astrodome show could end. Number 1. Horace Hunley this invention is interesting because when Hunley decided to invent his kind of submarine, the technology at the time was limited. Yet that did not stop him from engaging in science and engineering throughout his life. He developed the 40-foot submarine out of a cylinder boiler and was joined by a crew of seven. That sounds amazing until I say that the world's first successful combat submarine sank during a test run. What happened to the crew? Well, they also lost their lives when they failed to resurface the boat. As a tribute, the submarine was given the name Horace Hunley. This video reminds us of all the precautions we need to take before throwing ourselves into an experiment. So with all the life hack videos on the internet, you should be a little more careful too. Has anything ever gone wrong for you when you first tried something? Let us know in the comments. Be sure to leave a like on today's video and be sure to subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Also, turn on notifications to never miss a new upload because that's the last thing we want. That said, I'll see you in the next video.